nice lighting in here, but well, good morning. It is Tuesday and this is our second day in the hotel here and um, taking it easy today. Just kind of casually laying back, doing some laundry and just enjoying the long showers and the thorough face washes. Just really trying to take advantage of all the luxuries I have of being in a hotel room as opposed to a camper where it's virtually impossible to take long showers which is a good thing because you you do save on water um, so what I have here is some plain oatmeal and I put some strawberries and kiwi and banana and cinnamon and of course I brought my flax meal <laughs> from the camper uh, so that I can get my omega-3s and uh, more vitamins so yeah that's what I'm having for breakfast also went to the family fair market and I got for the first time in my life I, I'm not happy about this plastic but Sometimes when you're on the go, um, especially during this pandemic, um, I couldn't, for instance, I couldn't get my coffee, I couldn't use my reusable cup. So I had to get a plastic top, not happy about it, but uh, today I just wanted coffee. It's not an, every, it's not an everyday thing. Um, but yeah, so I got dragon fruit and I thought I would try it for the first time on camera. This is always super expensive. I get, correct me if I'm wrong, I can never find anything less than, you know, $8 for dragon fruit. This was $7.66. I'm pissed off that I paid that much for it, but I was like, damn, it's all cut up for me. I should try it for the first time. Wait, wait. Does it look appetizing? I don't know. It tastes like nothing. I mean... It doesn't have any flavor. <laughs> Why do people pay $8 for this? The texture is almost like a melon. Um, I wouldn't buy this again <laughs> because it's expensive and it didn't really enhance my life. So there's that. But I'm going to finish this meal and I'm probably going to pick up my laundry. I am going to digest my food, do a little bit of reading, some computer work, hence why I bought the coffee, and do an indoor workout because the the workouts I've been doing have all been outside and the mosquitoes and flies and ticks have been such a pest over here as we are living right by the Missouri Valley area and it has a lot of wetlands and tall grass and I'm pulling ticks off my dogs every day and I'm kind of paranoid about bugs crawling on me and you know i'm just trying to suck it up <laughs> the end of all this we're going to be traveling on the road going to the pacific northwest and it's been my dream location to live at and i'm so excited to live there and i'm pretty sure there's gonna be plenty of you know vegan food forests and state parks and we'll be by a coastline again i have not been to a beach in a long time i've always lived in a coastal state and i've always had access to a beach and i can't believe how much i've taken it for granted and how much i've missed running along the beach and just being by the ocean i was in the coast guard the ocean was a love-hate relationship for me but now being out of the coast guard and just having to enjoy it from the coastal side, I miss it. So. Mmm. Cheers.
Cheers. All right, so I'm getting ready to do the Chloe Tang 2020 Super Shred Challenge, and I'm probably gonna do a Lucy Fitness uh, booty band workout. I don't know which one I'm gonna do, but just really wanna work my glutes, take advantage of being indoor and AC. And I got my workout mat right here. I got the workout video right there. My audience for today are two sleepy dogs. And I just have a little MTV catfish playing here. And you know, we just gotta work with what we got sometimes. sad but you guys this is all I got right now some leftover quinoa salad with chickpeas in it I threw some walnuts in there my remainder strawberries from breakfast um, one slice of Ezekiel bread with peanut butter and some more strawberries and I'll probably have a protein bar in the car as I drive to pick up my husband but this is lunch so you know, you just gotta use what you got sometimes, and I think this will get me somewhat full. Wait, what about the trailer and all that? I got my DD214 out there. The car will be screwed. in the hotel. Girls are hanging out. Joey's finishing up her breakfast. I'm eating a little hummus wrap. Good stuff. Listen, a 31 year old woman needs to freaking take a shower. Not like shh, shh, and turn it off. Shh. I'm too old. I'm too old for that crap. Come on. Barnes and Nobles. I didn't know. Or you didn't do so well. Oh, man, you're 
Natural Painting Steps for a start on the roof painting. Come on.